the fact that Midnight was kind of going in a lot. Also, when Midnight did that, like, panic down B, he recognized it enough to up air instead yeah. of freaking out himself. For sure. So that was good on his part. So we're going in with Game & Watch in this. I'm not sure if this is a button check. No, I think they're get I think they're going in. Actually, you know what? I, I Okay, okay, yeah, they're yeah, going in. Yeah, yeah. That was really strange for a second. They sat there, both at zero. All right, so we got King Mega versus Insanguine, and I have not heard of either of these players, so this should be fun. Yeah, and I will say, uh, Insanguine did give, uh, did do the down air cancel to Ness, which is kind of a, a mark of like someone who at least knows more than just back throws. So. Wait, wait, what do you mean the down air? So Ness, ha so D Ness down air has auto cancel frames. Oh like, yeah, 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 yeah. So okay. it, it's a landing tool, basically. I was wondering what, what I was, I wondered if that was like some special technique. But, okay. Uh, it's, it's, a, it's just a nice way to give him a little bit right, crisper right. movement. We'll see, if, we'll see if that come back, comes back up. It is. It, it does look really cool when Ness when a Ness is very mobile with it. Yeah. Uh, but Game Watch, a, a tricky character, uh, someone who can really surprise you if you don't know the matchup. He hits way harder than he looks. Also, he has a crazy, like, he has a crazy comeback slash, like, just destroy you factor in his judgment hammer. Yeah. I was a uh, uh, there. Wow. Well, yeah, the ju or yeah. the regular hammer. Um, I was so, actually surprised to learn the other day uh, something about Game & Watch. Which is, so, his up smash is great. Everyone knows that. I didn't know his up smash is actually frame positive on shield. Oh, yeah. Like, even like even if you shield it, he gets an advantage on you. Yep. Uh, that's just gross. Uh, it's, such a good, it's such a good move. It's very easy to punish if he, if he doesn't hit your shield, though. Yes. And then that is something to watch out for in this match. Is, is trying to identify up uh, Game & Watch up smash habits yeah. and being ready with that punish. So, uh, King Mega coming on strong this, this match. Ooh. I just want you to know, note, both players so far have KO'd their opponent with a smash attack on the right side of Battlefield because the other person went over them. Yep. Both times. And that oh, is sorry, not a smash tag, with, with an attack. Right. Because the other character went over them. Yeah. I just think that's kind of funny. That they both kill each other basically <laughs> the same way. <laughs> uh, and that's really scary with both characters, um, especially uh, Game & Watch, because if you are on... He's like Mario. If you go on top of them, most Game & Watches have that reaction. They're like, bam, up smash. Yeah. Uh, you gotta watch out with that down air, though. That is not safe. Uh, especially against Ness. Ness gets so much off grabs. Uh, don't, like, don't just fall into that. Because that's, that, like, that's what Ness is waiting for. Like, there's no surprise there. Yep. Well, going for those back airs, uh, Game & Watch, of course, very light. So Game Watch could... Game Watch does smash is also super strong. It could totally KO Ness with this range. Oh, for sure. Uh, down his down smash is really strong as well. He has, like, incredible kill power and, and a few very good moves. Right. Ooh, that was a really... That was a really unsafe forward air. Yeah. Imagine if he had been at higher percent. That would have been a KO. Yeah. I'm not liking these down airs from King Mega. I, I just think they're, they're really risky. I don't know what he's going to get out of them. Uh, he's not going to get a KO. Uh, right. And uh, at this point, he's, I mean, at the edge, Gaming Watch will get back thrown. Oh, I like that little shimmy into the kind of reverse yeah. forward air. That was good. Uh, forward air being kind of yeah. tricky because it also hits a lot, or hits multiple times. Uh, Ness forward air at least. So, so one thing I've noticed is that both these players really like to full hop on, above their opponent on the ledge. Mm -hmm. Ooh, why? Uh, that was that, a forward air. That was a forward air. Yeah, I was about to say. <laughs> oh man, or even a down smash. Any anything besides what he did, basically. <laughs> you could have chaired him back throw. Yep, back throw. That's it. That that cost him the game. Yeah, he had that game. You, yeah, you want to, like, if you rewatch that VOD, you, that's that's where it is. That's where you lost. Oh, that if I rewatch it, oh, man. Those are the worst kinds of things to rewatch, too. Yeah, where you know you know there's that game at, game <laughs> losing mistake, and you're like, and it's at the end of the match, too, you're like, oh, there it is. <laughs> I could have won. Yeah. It's worse when, like, you could have won with it. Yeah. Uh, but it is, you know, that is a learning experience. You go back and you're like, there you go. There's a situation I know about now. Hopefully. Especially yeah. against Nasty. The like, thing is, it slowed down PK Thunder 2 so much. Yeah. <laughs> but now he has an info for next time. For this game. I would like to see more up smashes on King Mega. I mean, it's such a good. It's, it's safe. It's a good move. Yeah. Uh, I'd like to see more Bacon, to be honest. Yeah, Bacon's also like, fun. Like, I would like him to try to stuff Ness's approach mm -hmm. because Neff is, Ness is so floaty. And he's not super fast horizontal speed wise in the air. No. 
Uh, one thing that just happened is King Omega rolled backwards, and it resulted in him getting like completely nailed by PK Fire. Um, and that is something you gotta wa wa watch out with uh, with Ness, because PK Fire in a lot of situations doesn't do a whole lot. Like it tags you, but you can kind of get away from it. Uh -huh. But if he, if a uh, Ness can get a roll with it, or he can get the falling PK Fire and like right in the middle of you, that's when it leads to like a KO setup. Oh man, he just missed another PK Thunder two. Yeah, Punish. same same setup. You, uh, that's two now, so you gotta that put that in your memory banks. Like that is information you should have downloaded by now. Uh, also, he could just yep. Oh okay. yeah. Also, rip, he rip, could rip. just he could just run down and down B the PK Thunder. Yeah. This is a, this is a for again for a character that'll I mean Canada or, or Game and Watch is not you know let's say bottom five by any means, but it's a character few people put very high. But this is one of his matchups that's not bad. I think Game Watch is pretty good. I just think he has. Uh, I think he has potential that has yet to be tapped. Yes, for sure. Untapped I think I think potential. he's good too. Uh, what was it, uh, Reggie, the Mexican one, a Mexican Game Watch player? I. Oh, uh, he got really high at Evo, like <laughs> top 32. Uh, but anyway. Yeah. So we're pretty much back to even here. Um, that dash attack really good. Surprisingly though. Nice grab. He can just bucket that. There, there you is. go. There you go. He's got two in there already. Uh, another one, and that should be pretty devastating move. Uh, the bucket, uh, you know. Not yeah, just the bucket's wrong, crazy. But, not just wrong, but fast, like super fast. What's really scary though is, is like is the shield punish potential. Yeah. Like punishing an opponent for being in shield. Oh, he's going for the gimmicks. <laughs> you got to at least get a short up air. That was a really nice first hit up air to up mm. tilt. I really like that. All right, he's going for that uh, sausage like you wanted. Yeah. But he is he is losing, so <laughs> he can't just hide behind that. He could try to approach with it though, and I feel like Ness would have some problems. Ness is Ness is pretty comfortable. I mean, waiting for this kill, right? Like obviously, yeah. there it is. At that point, up air would have done it. Back air would have done it. A lot of things would have done it. Back that was it. So the falling, the falling up air, the surprisingly like large hitbox it has as I you're know. falling into the oh ground. Oh my god! As a, as a Lucas player, because Lucas is hitbox on his up air, it's like it's tiny. Not Ness's. Not Ness's. He's got a big forehead. He does, which is, <clears throat> I think Lucas should have, a, he has bigger hair. Yeah, but Ness is wearing a baseball cap, man. That's true. Hats over here, I'm sorry. All right, all right. 